Hi and welcome to our telehealth video information service. My name is Garvin and this video is on Trusil Nail Solution. So what is Trusil Nail Solution used for? It's used in the treatment of fungal nail infections. And how does it work? So Trusil Nail Solution contains the active ingredient thioconazole, which is an antifungal medicine used to treat infections caused by fungi, yeast and molds. So thioconazole kills fungi and yeasts by interfering with their cell membranes. It works by stopping fungi from producing a substance called ergosterol, which is an essential component of fungal cell membranes. The disruption in production of ergosterol disrupts the cell membrane. The cell membranes of fungi are vital for their survival. They keep unwanted substances from entering the cell and stop the contents of the cell leaking out. As thioconazole disrupts this, it kills the fungal cells. So Trusil nail solution is used to treat infections of the nails with fungi or dermatophytes, yeasts and moles. These types of infections are often difficult to eradicate because the nails are hard and difficult to penetrate and takes a long time to grow as new healthy tissues. Trusil nail solution is applied onto the infected nails like nail varnish. The nail solution forms a slightly greasy film on the nail which allows the medicine to penetrate through the nail into the nail bed and attack the infection. This nail solution should be used twice a day, so morning and evening. It is important that you continue with treatment without interruption until the infected section of nail has completely grown out, otherwise the infection will come back. In general, it can take 6 to 12 months treatment to clear up a nail infection. It is recommended that you see your doctor every 3 months during treatment to make sure the medicine is working correctly. Trusil should not be used in an allergy to any other antifungal medicines. And for pregnancy, this medicine should not be used if you're allergic to any of its ingredients. So pregnancy and breastfeeding, as said, the safety of this medicine during pregnancy has not been established. The manufacturer therefore advises that it should be avoided during pregnancy. And there's no information available regarding the safety of this medicine for breastfeeding. So seek advice from your doctor if you're breastfeeding and you want to use Trusil. The side effects, so common side effects include swelling of soft skin. Uncommon side effects include a rash, skin irritation around the nail being treated. And finally, side effects, which would be considered very rare, would be allergic reactions such as itching, swelling and blistering of the skin. So tingling sensation in the hands and feet and peeling of the skin. So nail disorders such as discoloration, pain or inflammation. So they'd be very rare side effects. How can this medicine affect other medicines or so possible interactions? This medicine is not known to affect any other medications. So that brings this telehealth video to an end. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments below or contact me through our website, mytelehealth.info or call into us at Lynch's Pharmacy in Douglas and Cork or ring us on 021 436 6923 to find out more. Thank you for watching. Stay healthy and stay informed.